Hi, my name is Richard Kitar. I'm the President and CEO of Aurora Marine Industries. Now the last time I showed you how we protected a piece of old uh, canvas from a canvas top on a boat. This time I'm going to show you something even more remarkable. Now first of all we've got these two blotter telltales. Put one in each cup. We're going to take a piece of tissue paper, put it over the cup, secure it with an elastic band, and this piece of tissue paper was treated 24 hours ago with canvas shield and allowed to cure. Now I'm going to take a pair of scissors and trim a little bit of this paper away so that you'll be able to see into the bottom of the jar. I've got a beaker of water here and I'm going to put some food coloring in there just to color the water so that you'll be able to see Put a couple drops on here and you can see that it's wetting the uh, the fabric here. You're going to do the same thing and look at that. It's just rolling around in there like, like ball bearings. Can you see that? This is on just everyday common tissue paper. So now we're going to add a little bit more. Give this one another shot. Two. Three. And once again, you can just see that it doesn't penetrate, it just rolls around uh, on the tissue. This one, give another shot. Oh, there it goes. You can already see that it's dripping through the bottom. Can you see it there? The uh, telltale is a dark brown. And you can see the water is wicked right through. This one, the water is still on the surface and the telltale is still a tan color and still uh, dry as a bone. And the interesting thing is that we've tried this, uh, this test in our labs and found that this, after a month, uh, the tissue was still bone dry. Well, I hope you enjoyed that demonstration. That's our new canvas shield. Thank you for watching.